Hi and welcome back. I am Steph Lyons here today with your full body workout. So for our workout today, you have five circuits. For the first four circuits, you have three moves. Each move you're gonna perform for 30 seconds. You're gonna repeat the circuit two times through and you get a 30 second rest at the end of the second round. On your fifth circuit, that's gonna kind of be our finisher circuit. So you're gonna have four moves. Three moves are gonna be performed for 30 seconds and that final move is gonna be a 60 second move. And again, we repeat that circuit two times through. As always, make sure you warm it up before you work it out and you meet me right back here. I'm gonna guide you today all the way through the workout, so grab your mat and your dumbbells and let's set up our workout. Here we go, so for circuit one, our first three moves. We have shoulder taps, mountain climbers, and push-ups. Remember, 30 seconds per move. We're gonna repeat it two times straight through and we'll get a 30 second rest at the end of the second round. So here we go, we meet on the mat. We're starting our shoulder, our shoulder taps. Here we go, opposite hand taps opposite shoulder. You're gonna want a wide stance here. Think about tightening up through your core and steadying your hips. Opposite hand touches opposite shoulder. Yes, so with this, we've got body weight to start us off today. Three straight minutes of body weight work. Get ready for your mountain climbers. Remember, in your mountain climbers, we're gonna stay heavy through the hands and shoulders, lighten the toes behind us. We're meeting there, here we go. Mountain climbers, nice and light in your toes, like you're touching hot coals behind you. I like to think about digging my finger pads into the mat, pressing up and away from the floor, and you are still tightening up your core right here. Good, push-ups are coming. You can hit your push-ups from your knees, or your toes. Try to keep your elbows tight to the body. Yes, here it is. We drop it down right into your push-ups. Let's go. Shoulders down, elbows tight. If your shoulders are already talking, great. <laughs> yes, keep your belly lifted. We are almost there. You've got 10 seconds right here. Exhale as you press up. We're gonna go back to our shoulder taps. Yes, here we go, back in shoulder taps, wide stance. Opposite hand touches opposite shoulder. Shoulders should feel like burning, should feel like fire. Oh, right where you need to be. Again, try to steady your hips, tighten through your core. Less than 10 seconds on the clock. Beating back in mountain climbers. Here we go. Right in, mountain climbers. Stay lifted through your core. Again, send your body weight forward. I know your shoulders are burning. Send your body weight forward. Stay light in your toes. Yes, we've got push-ups. I, who starts the workout with push-ups? Yes, here it is, right in for your push-ups. Down and up, core tight, elbows tight, shoulders down. I'm gonna get you off your hands and arms right after this. Less than 10. I the burn. We're gonna be on our feet, get ready. Yes, right here, you are done with your push-ups. So we get our 30 second rest, we talk about where we're going next. We have our alternating forward lunge, grab your dumbbells, step it forward. From there, we hinge at the hips for a bent over dumbbell row. Then we stand up, overhead shoulder press. Woo, get ready, shake it out, find your weights, and let's get set. Alternating forward lunge, here we go, we're in, step it forward. Think about dropping the back knee down. Oh, yes, so good. I love talking through the workouts. You get to hear me breathe the whole time. <laughs> 
Good, big power out of your front foot. Big drive. We've got our rows right here, hinging forward. Bent over dumbbell row, big squeeze behind you. Even in your dumbbell row, back is flat, core is tight. Exhale as you row. Less than 10. We're going up for our shoulder press. Stay with it right here. Yes, bring it up. Here it is. Shoulder press. As if your shoulders aren't already on fire, you get a little extra love on them. Good, we're gonna repeat this round, and if you can get a little heavier, you grab heavier dumbbells. Back to your alternating forward lunge. Ah, yes. Round two, here we go. Can you get heavier? Where do you find the challenge? Step it forward, big press back. Keep a tall, proud chest, even at the bottom of the lunge. Yes. We'll be back down on the mat after this. You're doing great. Yes, right here, we bend it over. Dumbbell rows, big squeeze, big pull, big row. Almost there. Ah, oh, the grip. The grip. We're gonna go overhead shoulder press coming up. There we go. Up overhead. Going through the power. Exhale. Press it up. If you win heavier, you're going a little slower. That's okay. We got 10. And here it is. Your 30 second rest, you've earned it. All right. We're meeting back down on the ground. We've got a plank row, not a renegade, no push up, just plank row. Use your dumbbells in your plank, we row and row. From there, plank jacks. Legs jump in and out. We meet on the elbows for a plank saw. Shake out your arms. We've got some shoulders burning. Here we go, we meet on the mat, plank rows. Let's do it. Again, wide stance gives you a little more stability. Pull the weight back towards your hip, not towards your armpit. Shoulder pulls down away from your ear. Tighten through your core. We're gonna stay in the plank position. Legs jump in and out. Plank jacks. Here we go. Jumping the legs in and out. Core stays tight. Now what happens when we get tired is our butt sticks up. I want you to keep your weight forward heavy through your hands. Core is tight, butt is down. We're coming down to the elbows shortly. We've got our saw. Here it is, elbows down, legs together, rolling forward and back in your toes. Core is tight. Ooh, shoulders are still burning. I know you love it. And we repeat the circuit. Get ready for it. Back in our plank rows. Hang tight, just a few seconds left here. Yes, let's go back in. Plank rows, wide stance, core tight, hips are steady. Pull the weight back towards your hip. Yes. 
shoulders and back. Hello. Here it is. Plank jacks, move your weights. Jumping the legs in and out. Remember, try to keep your weight forward. Try not to shift the shoulders back. Keep your shoulders directly over your wrist. Core is lifted. Belly is tight. Get ready, elbows down, coming up. You've got your saw, here we go. We're back up on our feet after this. Yes, stay in the move. I know it's burning, I know your abs are on fire. Stay with this right here, you can do it. Ah, yes, Woo, 30 second rest. Ah, here we go. Let's talk about where we're going next. Circuit number four, we're almost at the end. It flies, time flies when you're having fun. We go one and a half goblet, weights at the chest. Sink down, half up, down, recover. Then we move right into our standing chest fly. Squeeze your chest as you bring the weights up. Finish, overhead triceps. Grab one heavy, one and a half goblet. Here we go. So we're gonna sink down, half up. All the way down, cover at the top. Squeeze your legs. Squeeze your glutes as you come up. Yes. Woo, got about 10 right here. We're gonna go standing chest fly. Ah, let's do it. Weights at the side. Squeeze up and together. Focus on squeezing your chest. You can do it. Stay with it, overhead triceps. Yes. Here we go. Give me the back of the arm. Big full extension. Right up to the top. Yes. Keep breathing. Keep breathing. We're going to be back, back in our one and a half goblet. Can you go heavier? Round two. Yes, here we go. Staying. One and a half in the goblet. Sink down. Halfway up. All the way down, recover to the top. Good work, your core is still tight here. Shoulders, arms, probably burning right where I want you. Yes, back in, here it is, standing chest fly. Breathe. You're doing fantastic. After this, one more circuit. This is your finisher. It's the four move one. One of the moves, 60 seconds long. You're gonna love it. But we still have our overhead triceps, so one more move here. Yes, here it is. Bring your arms up overhead. Yes. I'm getting a little shaky, shaky over here. Hopefully you're right there with me. Yes, we get our 30 second rest. Final circuit coming up. Yes, ditch your weights. Here we go, let's talk about the last four moves in your workout. We're gonna be back down on the mat. We have a plank to pike. Opposite hand touches opposite toe. From here, spider plank, take your knee wide. We're gonna hold our high plank. We're gonna keep our weights nearby. 
You've got your makers. Push up row, row. We jump it in, stand and press. Here we go, get ready. We're in plank to pike. Three, two, and one, let's go. So in your plank, pike up. Opposite hand touches opposite toes. Yes. Lift through your belly. Shoulders are still on fire. Coming forward all the way in the plank. Spider planks up next. We take the knees wide. Here we go. Right knee, right elbow or tricep, left knee, left elbow or tricep. Take them wide. Oh yes, we're almost there. All you have is your plank hold. Your arms should be burning. My shoulders are on fire. Here we go, hold your plank. Think about zipping up your legs. Shoulders down, if you need to modify, put your knees down. Now scoop your belly. Scoop your belly up and away from the ground. And think about drawing your hands and toes towards each other underneath you. Oh, there it is. We've got our makers, grab your weights. Push up row, row, jump it in, stand and press. Here we go, grab your weights. 60 seconds on this one. So you're gonna push up. We've got the row and the row. We jump our feet outside our hands. Bottom of the squat, hammer curl, stand and press. Bring it back down. Yes, 60 seconds right here. How many can you do? Yes, there we go. Keep going, keep pushing. Jump it in. Stand and press. We're gonna start it over. Woo! Stay in your maker. We go back to our plank to pike with the toe touch. Five seconds here. Whew. Yes. Push your weights to the side. Plank to pike. Add the toe touch. Opposite hand, opposite toes. Oh. This is the full body shake right here. Get ready. Spider planks coming up. Yes, spider planks, you're in. Right knee, right elbow or tricep. Left knee, left elbow or tricep. Use your core, keep your butt down. Shoulders are steady. Oh, they're burning. Keep going. <laughs> I believe in you, you can do it. Oh, we hold our plank. Here we go. Hold it. Zip up your legs. Squeeze your inner thighs. Shoulders pack down. Scoop your belly. Every time you exhale, tighten your core. We've got one final move. You're almost there, makers. 60 seconds, they take us home. Here it is, grab your dumbbells. Set it up, it's the push up row, row. Final 60 on the clock. You can do it. Finish where you can. Don't worry about the time. Just do the work. Yes, you can, yes, we can. We're almost there. Beautifully done. You're finishing strong, I know you can do it. <laughs> 
How do you do it right here? Seconds left. Yes, and you are done. You've completed your full body workout today. I am so proud of you. I hope you did something new and challenged yourself. As always, fill your tank with love and light. Go share your love and light with the world. And until tomorrow, be good and be safe. I won't make it easy for you now. You got two minutes of my time.